Hey, what's up guys? Welcome to another episode of the channel. If you do like this video, hit that like button. And if you're new to the channel, make sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell so that you're notified of when I release new content. So today we are finally going to be working on the fuel filter or the fuel pump. I need to go to AutoZone or Riley's, get some bright cleaner, get some simple green in a five gallon bucket. So with that being said, let's go on, head, let's go on, head out, get shit taken care of. Poor girl hasn't been ran in who knows how long. A few moments later. All right, so they did not have a uh, five gallon bucket that I needed, but we got the washer fluid for the Mazda, which should work now. We got new wiper blades coming for this car pretty soon. And then we also got the simple grain. Now I'm gonna head over to Lowe's right now, and I'm gonna go grab that five gallon bucket so that uh, we can soak the fuel pump assembly. Okay, last where we left off on the fuel pump, we had this absolute monstrosity. So what we're going to do now is we are going to take this simple green right here so we'll probably fill the bottom of it with a good amount of simple green we'll just fill it with water and then we'll put the fuel pump in there so now we are going to dip this monstrosity in here oh i hear it making bubbles so it's not going to fill up all the way and get everything out, but it has the important stuff. So once we can clean off all that extra shit, so we can get to the plugs and whatnot, then we'll worry about um, then we'll worry about the top and cleaning that off. All right. So we're going to attempt to get the fuel out of the tank. So we got as much fuel as we could out of the fuel pump for now, but we're pretty much in a good position to drop the tank. So what I'm gonna do now is we're actually gonna look at the fuel pump and kind of start cleaning it off and taking things off so that we can start seeing what the damage is. The tank is pretty dirty and I'm not gonna lie. If I'm gonna do it right, I should probably drop it just for the sole fact of it's probably gonna be better in the long run. I don't want to have to get a new tank and then like spend like the hundreds of dollars that it would be into like getting it and then having it shipped here and then I have to drop it regardless. So if I'm going to drop it, might as well see if I can clean and save this tank. I've got the simple green and if I need to, I can get access to stronger stuff like purple power. So with that being said, we're going to put the fuel tank or fuel pump. Um, it doesn't hurt to have safety glasses on because you never know what'll happen. Um, and definitely don't want fuel and shit getting in your eye and then you have to go to the ER and then you can't work on your car because you went blind. Oh, God damn. All right. Yeah. Somehow I'm gonna have to find a way to get this off. I gotta clean. Oh, shit. One eternity later. All right, so it's been a couple hours. We got a nylon brush here. Just kind of cleaning things off right now. Let me turn it off. I don't know if I kind of trying to clean it up. You know, just kind of agitating everything. Clean it up as you know best I can. You know, agitate it a little bit clean everything up. I don't want to like, I want everything to be nice and clean and stuff like that. Like if I'm going to put time into this project car, I want to do it right the first time. I don't want to like sit around, kind of 
I don't want to have to buy everything. If I can fix it and if I can fix it and clean it up and make it better and be able to properly use everything, then I'm going to do that. So with that being said, I want to thank you guys for watching this video. If you did like this video, hit the like button. If you're new to the channel, make sure to subscribe. Hit that notification bell so you're notified whenever we release new content on the channel. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye, guys.